Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'll be doing something a little bit different and it will be a yes style haul but also like it's okay not to be okay theme. So basically dressing myself up as the main character and just showing you guys some inspired looks from the drama. So let's get started. In the drama, the main female character is named um, Ko Moon-yong. Moon-yong? Sorry if I'm don't name it right but yeah uh, Moon Young and so she is such a fashionista in the drama to be honest a lot of or majority of the outfits the accessories the handbag everything that she wears from top to bottom are actually mainly luxury goods but obviously cost wise I I'm not able to actually afford it but I'll put a few links down in the description box below if you guys want to splurge a bit and then see you know actually get the exact same outfit I'll put like all the links where you can get them as well from like different articles but for me I decided to get a little bit of like dupe from YesStyle and I've never shopped from YesStyle before so it's actually my first time shopping like fashion related stuff from YesStyle because usually I would just buy like beauty related stuff so it'll be interesting to see how all the clothes really fit me I've actually bought three outfits to try in the drama there's actually a few themes that people have mentioned when noticing what common young was wearing so there's like five different theme or style that she goes to so I actually gonna show you guys three of the theme the first style is called sleeves that slays or sleeve that is like puffy because a lot of the dresses that Ko Moon Young was wearing in the drama really really stood out because it's not just like your typical normal sleeve like this it really puff up around the shoulder area or the arm area or even like just the chest area to make the whole dress really pop so one of it I have is this black polka dot dress here now in the drama there's a bit of like flariness more puffy on the shoulder area but this one doesn't really puff as much but it is polka Dot. It um, flares really nicely at the bottom as well like the um, drama but yeah I'll just show you guys like side by side and which episode is featured in as well if you guys are wondering. Now with this one I can't remember what size I got it but this is actually a perfect size for me but again I'll put all the info here so you guys know what size I got it in but I find that this one is really comforting when wearing and it's very airy at the bottom. Definitely very perfect for spring or summer at the moment we are hitting spring already so I actually wore this out today and just feels so so comfortable and it does have like this black layer at the bottom as well to cover up you know the bottom area but this is beautiful the only thing I don't like about this dress is the button at the front it has like four buttons here as you can see and it has like this elastic thing that you have to like button it up and because I don't have the best pencil grip this actually took me ages to button it up and I've just basically unbuttoned one for you guys but you can see it has like this really thin elastic band oh my god I can't even pick this up guys yeah thin elastic band here and then you basically just put on the button but yeah this took me ages but other than that once I button up it's fine and in the on the waist area it has like this elastic thing which really meet really nicely and sort of like make your boobs look a little bit bigger as well the second theme is like pure innocence or like fairy like um, outfits which means that it's a lot of white pastel very pure looking very innocent looking and the one I got is like a lacy one and this one is really really nice because it's basically full on lace and um, it has a zip at the back too and it flares up at the bottom as well so this one is basically just past your mid length area and it comes with this like lace thing that you actually wrap around the waist area and that's what I did because if I don't put this on then the dress will just look like really straight and doesn't really show my shape body so I actually use this lace to wrap around the ribbon area so this one I've seen it a lot in Ko Moon Young's um, drama like in it's okay not to be okay like she has so many different type of white lacy dress in the videos which looks really really nice and really suit her some of it even like when she wore it as pajamas it just pulls off just like as a casual look and it just yeah this one really makes her look very soft looking makes her look a little bit like very fragile because in the drama she always act like this really tough independent girl but I feel like every time she wears like a white related dress it just makes you feel like so 
like you just want to give her a hug because she just looks so petite and so small and just you know like yeah fragile but yeah so this is this one and I don't own any type of dress like this in my collection just because I don't really wear white outfits so this one is actually very different on me the only thing about this is that the layer inside compared to the black polka dot dress this is actually quite sheer so you just have to be cautious of what you actually wear underneath I actually had like black shorts underneath as well which was quite obvious so the next time I wear this I just have to make sure that I probably have to wear like nude sort of underwear or like bottom you know at the bottom so that it doesn't really show um, in front of this dress but other than that this dress is actually really beautiful and the material for this is actually quite thick which I'm actually really surprised the last outfit is business with a twist which is what I'm currently wearing right now so basically in the drama you see her wearing a lot of like blazer type outfit or like business looking outfit but she you know have a twist with it which basically the bottom area you never really see her wearing like pants like business outfit it's more like either a skirt or a dress or mini skirt so it's very different it's like business looking but also very feminine of her and just make her look very sexy and stylish as well which I really like the one that I got is like basically like a black blazer dress the one in the drama is so much nicer because you can really see the skirt looking bottom at the bottom where it flares out this one I think I got mine in the size large which I think is a little bit too big for me because it actually doesn't show my shape so if this is a little bit much more tighter so if I go for a medium size I would say that this actually looks really really nice on me like I actually quite like it so I might get my mom to actually tighten it up a little bit for me because the belt buckle area here you can't really tighten it anymore but I really like this like because I don't really wear blazer and this one looks really really good even my husband was like this actually looks really nice but because of the length I would probably wear like tights underneath just like communion in the drama as well and high heels I think that would look really really lovely but yeah in the drama she has a lot of business outfit inspired video um, outfits which looks really really cool and I've never seen it before and yes she just pulls them off really well all right and the last thing would be like accessories and she has a lot of really nice accessories that really stood out in the drama whether it's like sunglasses or earrings or handbags so I'm gonna show you guys a few inspired ones that I managed to get from yesterday first two would be sunglasses and common young wear a lot of oversized sunglasses in the drama partially because obviously it's in fashion and also to emphasize her petite looking face as well by wearing like such an oversized sunglasses I'm not the type to usually wear sunglasses so buying this I'm like when am I actually gonna wear this but I'll probably try and wear it like during summer maybe or like when the weather is like sunny but this first style is, has like this really nice gold frame to it and a bit like cat eye looking and yeah and this looks like this I'm gonna put this on and show you guys ignore the ring light but I think this actually looks pretty nice but yeah this is the first one second one is also an oversized one and this one has much more of like a thicker frame so it has like a black frame and a bit squarish and like a gold in the middle and this one looks way more elegant way more like business like I guess but yeah this looks pretty good as well. Last three items would be earrings and Komunyong has a lot of variety of earrings in the drama and a lot of them are very elegant looking and very minimalistic but stands out at the same time so this is the first one and has like this rectangle looking pin earring dangle dangle earring I don't know how to describe this but I like this one. Second earring would be another dangle one and this one is much more smaller and um, petite looking and this one has like this green pole thing at the bottom which looks really really nice and on the ring area where the start is it has like this I don't know sparkling looking thing around it too but I feel like this is actually really nice and different looking too but yeah I actually 
like this one too so yeah now the last one is actually not from yes style but i decided to show you guys as well because i felt like it was very similar to one of the earrings that kong Moon Young was wearing and this one is actually from a new zealand shop called olivia new zealand but i thought i'll just feature it in here because i really like this earring as you can see it looks like it has like this chain loop going like like a chain hoop theme going and Communion was wearing something very similar probably a little bit smaller but I feel like this looks really, really nice so I thought I'll just feature in here for you guys to see and if you guys are in New Zealand you can check out this earring if you guys are interested those are the items that I got from YesStyle and I hope you guys enjoyed this let me know what you guys think let me know if you guys want me to do another drama theme inspired outfit videos I I'm very impressed with the purchases I got from Yesta because again I've never shopped like fashion related stuff from them and yeah the qualities are really decent the shipping it actually shipped pretty pretty quick but the only downside was that the New Zealand system was like terrible with the shipping like they had it in the warehouse for like six days and didn't send it to me and I had to like chase them up but other than that Yesta shipped them out really really quick and I'll put all the links of all these items in the description box below if you guys want to check it out and don't forget to use my discount code if you guys want to save a little bit more from your style but you don't have to if you guys don't want to but yeah any more questions and comments just put it down in the comment box below and i'll reply to you guys as soon as i can and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys